Hey guys, it's Emily with TeacherMade.com. I'm here to welcome you to TeacherMade and show you how you can get started creating your very own digital worksheets. All right, so when you are in your account and you sign in, you will land here. Your landing page will look just like this, except your page, if you're new, will be empty. Right under here where it says My Worksheets, all of this will not be there until you create all of your awesome documents. So let's get started. You're going to click Create Worksheet. Once you click Create Worksheet, you'll be able to give your document a title, a description, and a background. In the description, you can describe it as well as link or use goals or standards, anything that you'd like to describe your worksheet. Our goal for today is to understand and be able to apply the tools of TeacherMade's awesome digital worksheet creator. So now I'm going to add my worksheet. I've already downloaded a PDF file and it's here. So I'm just going to drag and drop this file into the worksheet backdrop box. And once it has populated, you'll see all of the pages here. Once again, you can upload something that's upwards of 12 pages. You can upload images and all different types of files, okay? So when you see what pages, this is where we get to choose what pages we want to go into the digital file world. So I want both of these pages. If you didn't want both of these pages, you just click on it. And once that red frame disappears, you'll know that that page is not going to go into the created worksheets, okay? But I want this worksheet, so I'm going to bring this with us. So we're going to click on the Create Worksheet button here in blue. And once you create your worksheet, now you're in the Edit Worksheet screen. Once you're in the Edit Worksheet screen, you'll be able to make the magic happen. You should also see a menu bar and a toolbar. Our menu bar is here and our toolbar is here. There are a rich set of icons on the horizontal toolbar. When you click on one, your cursor changes to crosshairs and you're ready to draw on top of your background image. For example, if I wanted to add text boxes into this document, I would click on this T with the box around it and then I would create a box wherever I wanted my students to type. Now, here's a quick hack. You can hit Control D and it'll duplicate your responses. So this makes life a lot easier. You can just drag and drop your text boxes wherever you'd like and you have a uniform set of text boxes which, like I said, makes it a lot easier. Now that you have your boxes everywhere that you'd like them to be, you can click on the box and click Edit Short Answer. This is where you can select your points and list your correct answer. You'll click Save Changes and continue to do so all throughout your worksheet. For every tool on the toolbar, the process is the same. Click, draw, edit, save. Go ahead and explore the toolbar and all the different types of activities and answers that are supported in the TeacherMade app. When you're done, go to the very top of the nav bar on the screen and click My Worksheets here. you'll see a list of worksheets that you've created. You're going to go over to the right side of the screen and find the blue Actions button. Once you click the blue Actions button, a selection menu appears. You can return to editing your worksheet. You can change the name or description, make a copy, preview, or delete your worksheet. When you want to assign the worksheet to your students, Use the action menu and click Assign. That's all there is to it. Now you're a digital worksheet making master.